Ever wondered how far apart to plant strawberries for optimal growth? Well, you're not alone. This seemingly simple question is a critical factor in successful strawberry cultivation, and the answer isn't one size fits all. The correct spacing can vary greatly from as close as 8 inches to as far apart as several feet. Intriguing, isn't it? This spacing decision is influenced by a variety of factors. First, the type of strawberry plant you're growing. Different varieties have different growth habits and space needs. Secondly, your expectations as a gardener play a role. Are you looking for quick berry production or are you willing to wait for larger, juicier berries? Close spacing might give you an early crop, but you may have to compromise on berry size and face an increased risk of disease. On the other hand, wider spacing requires more patience, allowing for natural propagation and the potential for larger berries. So the question is, how far apart should you plant your strawberries? Let's delve into the nuances of this gardening conundrum. The spacing between your strawberry plants can range from 8 inches to several feet. But what does this mean for your sweet red treasures? Let's dive into the world of strawberry plant spacing and discover how it affects the growth and yield of your delightful berries. Choosing the right spacing for your strawberry plants is akin to solving a puzzle. Each piece, or in this case, the distance between each plant, plays a vital role in the overall picture. Let's start with closer spacing, which can be anywhere from 8 inches to a foot apart. This option can lead to quicker berry production. It's like the fast track to a bounty of strawberries. But be warned, you might be trading quantity for size. Closer spacing can result in smaller berries. Plus, there's an increased risk of disease due to the lack of airflow and potential for overcrowding. Now, what about farther spacing? This can range from a foot to several feet apart. It's the route for those who believe that good things come to those who wait. Farther spacing allows for natural propagation, giving your plants room to grow and spread. The result? Larger, juicy strawberries. But remember, patience is a virtue here. It might take a bit longer to see your harvest come to fruition. As you see, finding the right balance in spacing is key to achieving the strawberry harvest you desire. Whether you're after a quick yield of smaller berries or you're playing the long game for larger fruits, the choice of spacing is yours to make. It's all about understanding your strawberry plants and their needs and figuring out what works best for your garden and your goals. Now that we've covered the basics of spacing, let's talk about different planting systems and why they matter. Two of the most common systems for planting strawberries are the matted row system and the hill system. The matted row system involves planting strawberries about one and a half to two feet apart in rows that are four feet apart. This system is ideal for June bearing strawberries, which send out many runners. The space between the plants allows these runners to root and form a mat of strawberry plants, hence the name. On the other hand, the hill system is better suited for ever-bearing and day-neutral strawberries. In this system, strawberries are planted in raised beds or hills, with plants spaced about one foot apart. The runners are removed to encourage the plants to produce more fruit, but no matter which planting system you choose, regular maintenance is critical. This includes removing runners in the hill system or managing them in the matted row system. Weeding is also crucial, as strawberries don't compete well with weeds. The health of your strawberry plants can be improved by regular feeding and watering. Strawberries prefer a slightly acidic soil, so consider testing your soil and adjusting its pH levels if necessary. Remember, 
A successful strawberry cultivation doesn't just depend on how far apart you plant your strawberries, but also on how you plant them and how well you maintain your garden. If you found this information useful, please like, share and subscribe to get more content.